How do you get your first six-figure job? Man, dude. This one we're at right now is the biggest one we've done. And it's not the biggest one we have on schedule, though. I have another one. It's a high six-figure job. Pretty cool. My first job was like 600 and I was like blown away. I was like, dude, that's the biggest job ever. Because what I was doing before was mowing lawns. So when you're mowing lawns, 600 bucks, you're like, oh my God, $600. I just mowed 24 lawns in one day. So when I had that job, I was like blown away. I'm like, dude, we made it. We made it, we made it to the top. <laughs> and what I didn't realize was that was nothing. We're building a fence all the way. All the way down. Look, man. We're starting the fence. So look, all this area right here is gonna be all lawn. Over there is gonna be concrete. Over here. There is gonna be like a little kitchen. Fence is done. That was quick. That only took like two days. Check it out, man. Just that little piece. That's how short we were on wood. Can't be short on wood, man. The fence went up quick. It was not long for the fence to go up. Now it's time for the retaining wall. This is also gonna go pretty quick. So before, we used to put the retaining wall on a bed of base rock. And now what we do is 
we put concrete first and then we just lay the blocks on top check it out The retaining wall, almost done. Only thing that's got to go on is the caps. These sprinklers are in. Crazy. That's a lot. Then this goes all the way. This is for the main line because we need water. So this is where the main is. When the guys built the house, they only put one main, and this is it right here. And it goes in like that. And also, the sprinkler wire goes in here too. So I started this whole landscaping deal January of 2016. And my very first job was for uh, one of my friend's mom. Barry got me a job, and I was so excited. Well, actually, he didn't get me a job. He just introduced me. I had to close the deal. He made an introduction. So, I, he, he gets a little credit. Maybe this much. I shut the deal down. Because I convinced her. I'm like, listen. Trust me. I will do this. I will do this great. This is going to be a great job. And, uh, they trusted me. And we signed the contract. It was for like 20 grand. Now, that job should have been for around 40 but it didn't matter to me I didn't I actually didn't make a dime on that job but she was nice enough to where I was honest with her and I told her listen I'm like I'm going negative I'm like can you help me out I don't need to make money I just don't I don't want to go negative and they did help a brother out and I appreciate that yeah man look at this we got a little skid steer action What's up, bro? Finally here. Yeah. Man, I've been waiting this thing. You've been waiting for it for a heck of a long time. Yes. Sorry. No worries. It's all good. How do you want to get this off? Uh, I need a forklift to get this off, and then I can offload it myself. 